This representation of qubits is great, but what if we wanted to apply a gate to a certain qubit? How would we indicate that we wanted to, let's say, apply an X gate to the second qubit in this state? For this, we use a diagram called the quantum circuit. Here is an example of one. On the vertical, we have the qubits, each line representing a singular qubit. The states on the left are the initial states of the qubits. The boxes are the quantum gates, and the letters on the boxes are the type of gate we are applying. For example, this is an X gate. These boxes are measurements, and represent us measuring the qubit. The horizontal is the order in which we apply the gates. We start from the left and go to the right. Sometimes, you will also see psi states pointing to different points in the circuit. These are used to represent the state of the system at different points during the algorithm. Let's go through this circuit. At psi sub 0, we have the state 0, 0, 1. Then at psi sub 1, we apply an X gate to the second qubit. At psi sub 2, we apply a Hadamard gate to the second qubit, giving us this state. Then at psi sub 3, we apply an X gate to both the first qubit and the third qubit, giving us this state. Then at psi sub 4, we measure the qubits, so we will get one of these states with these probabilities.